Even if I can't take a picture with you, that doesn't stop me taking pictures of you. He whipped out his phone and followed her to the deli counter, snapping away while she looked at the turkey. F the turkey, she thought, hurrying to the checkouts. He followed her there too. She got into the queue. Before her were rows and rows of magazines and newspapers, and on all of them, under the most shocking and disgusting headlines, was her. The other customers noticed as well. They looked at the magazines, looked at her. And now they too pulled out their phones, like zombies. Meg caught two cashiers sharing a horrible smile. After paying for her groceries, she walked outside, straight into a group of four men with their iPhones aimed at her. She kept her head down, rushed up Kensington High Street. She was nearly home when a horse-drawn carriage came rolling out of Kensington Palace Gardens. The palace gate was blocked. She was forced back along the main road where the four men picked up the scent again and chased her all the way to the main gate, screaming her name. When she finally got inside not caught, she'd phoned her best girlfriends, each of whom asked, Is he worth this, Meg? We just held each other until I slowly became aware of the most delicious smells. You mean, after all that, you still made lunch? I wanted to feed you before I left.